So here in our ongoing series, to point out how horrible the situation we're in once again, and no one seems to be upset about how horrible the situation is, everyone seems to be angry at the symptom of the situation, which is Donald Trump. And what is the situation? Unbelievable economic inequality caused by the corporate capture of our government. So our, now, our, now our economy is run at the behest of Wall Street and corporations. That's why, when, well, that's why the stock market goes up in the middle of a pandemic when everyone's losing their job. Okay? All right. Here is from four years ago we found ourselves in this situation. And Chris Hedges and Robert Reich... Two good guys had a difference of opinion. Robert Reich was here to tell you why you had to vote for Hillary Clinton. And Chris Hedges was there to tell you why we need to find a way to walk away from this two-party system and do it right now. And because if we don't, we're going to get a worse Trump. And we have to find a way. And Robert Reich was uh, arguing the opposite. And uh, he even, even in his argument, admits... So yesterday we played you the first part of Chris Hedges when he was doing this debate, and it was a smackdown. If you haven't seen it, you should go see it. He talks for about six, seven minutes straight, and it is just like a bang, 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 like you've never heard before. So here today uh, is the second part of that, and uh, let's play it for you. For four years to, to develop an alternative, uh, another Bernie Sanders type candidate uh, with a, an independent party outside the Democratic Party that will take on Hillary Clinton, assuming that she uh, is elected and that she runs for re-election, and that also uh, develops uh, the uh, infrastructure of a third party that is a true new progressive party. That's Robert Reich saying what we need. That's him, the Hillary voter, saying four years ago what, what we need in America. For four years to, to develop an alternative, uh, another Bernie Sanders type candidate uh, with a, an independent party outside the Democratic Party that will take on Hillary Clinton, assuming that she uh, is elected and that she runs for reelection and that also uh, develops uh, the uh, infrastructure of a third party that is a true new progressive party. That's what he was advocating for four years ago. Someone who was advocating for you to vote for Hillary Clinton was advocating for the formation of a third party to stand up against Hillary Clinton and the Democrats. And instead of that happening, Bernie Sanders went on to squelch the movement to start an actual third party that could actually compete with the Democrats. He sheep herded every progressive's energy into that corporate party, and now you're a bad person if you question Joe Biden. That was him four years ago saying what we should have been doing for the last... What should we have been doing for the last four years, Robert Reich, Hillary Clinton voter? What should we have been doing? For four years to, to develop an alternative, uh, another Bernie Sanders-type candidate uh, with a, an independent party outside the Democratic Party that will take on Hillary Clinton, assuming that she uh, is elected and that she runs for re-election, and that also uh, develops uh, the... Uh, infrastructure of a third party that is a true new progressive party. So she, he was saying back then four years ago, if Hillary Clinton beats Trump, there should, we should spend this next four years to creating a real independent party with a real infrastructure to challenge Hillary Clinton. If she runs for reelection, that's Bill Clinton's labor secretary, Robert Reich was saying that's what we should have been doing these last four years. We didn't do it. We built a movement that Bernie Sanders completely shattered. I laugh because you got to laugh cause, or else you'll cry. So there you go. That's so what, it, and what are we doing? This is exactly what we are doing. We are building a third party. It's called, uh, so that's this Sunday, the People's Convention, Movement for a People's Party. It'll be broadcast on this channel, right here at the Jimmy Dore, what is this called? 
Yeah, Jimmy Dore Show. The Jimmy Dore Show? But yes. what? YouTube slash the Jimmy Dore Show? You're just Jimmy Dore YouTube. Show. YouTube.com, gonna... whatever the fuck you're watching right now. Chris Hedges will be speaking also. Chris and Hedges I think will D- be speaking. Danny Glover. And Danny Glover. Cornell West, Nina Turner, Marion Williamson, uh, Ryan Knight, Jade to the D, uh, Senator Mike Gravel. Hey, everybody, this is the part where I tell you where all our live shows are, but there aren't any. And then this is why I tell you we join our premium program, get extra content, but nobody's got a fucking job. So just enjoy the video. <laughs> 